be underway. And our live game is Ghana against Croatia. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Becklin beside me. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. There's the whistle and here we go. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? I would say the Croatian Dario Schirne. Uh, he's been captain material for a number of years now. Very neat and tidy in all he does. And for a fullback getting forward, he can use his, his wing skills of old to carve out an opening. Okay, interesting. Looks to slip it through. Away from immediate danger. Patel. Tries lifting it over. Clears it out of harm's way. Some stupid defending to ensure they got no further. Perisic. And it's Mandzukic. Pumps it upfield. That's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. Perisic. Well, each team knows that they're still well below standard, and it's a question of uh, which can uh, find a way out. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Looking to hit the front line. Schoener, Brozovic, Modric, Rakitic, Modric, uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right, but Importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment, and that will pay off. That is wayward. I think he's done very well to get into such a good position in front of the goal, but he just couldn't put in the telling touch. to thread it through it's a brilliant interception and he's there to hoof it away Rakitic Mandzukic pumps it forwards oh good interception and the first half is done how would you review the first half well, the manager surely got to look for one or two creative changes now. They need some service up front. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. Ghana, pretty fortunate not to be trailing at half-time. They've been lacklustre and, and second best for me. And if ever a situation demanded a telling off from the boss, it's this one. He has to spark a reaction. Schoener. And it's Patel. Croatia are keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. You can get that clear. To throw in. Who's going to make this theirs? They've managed to get it away. That's a case of crossing and hope, and unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. Very few chances to talk off, Jim. Defences, it seems, on top here. 
Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection on what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. And Jukic goes for goal! Really well taken goal! Finally, the deadlock is broken! Croatia produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it is a strong end product. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. Now the pass. The referee has given a corner. Rakitic. It's a loose ball. And that's off target. Well, that's understandable because they haven't found it easy against this defence. And shooting from that sort of range, it's not the answer. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Dire need of a breakthrough, can they? Well, the easy thing to do at this late stage, Peter, is to let heads go down, but these lads have other ideas. And out to safety. Gets it into the middle. He's hit it first time. Well, no doubt if he'd sacrificed some of the power he was trying to put into that and, and favour better technique then I think he might have had more joy Schoener and that will be the final act one goal settled it a tense and exciting game that just got away well there's no shortage of effort and commitment from them they were just undone by that second half goal many thanks to Jim and with that it is a very good night